I always have mixed feelings about April fishing. On the one hand, it's great because you're finally into, you know, saltwater game fish after a long winter, but it's all really nighttime fishing in April for the striped bass because, um, you know, striped bass are the only fish on the menu and in the early season, they, you know, there's not really much of a day bite. You know, they only seem to feed at night. So you gotta be out at night and that's really the only time you're, you're catching fish in April. As May rolls around, you know, you start to get a little more of a day bite with the striped bass, and then also bluefish enter the picture. So, you know, you can do some of your fishing during the day, but April, pretty much just nighttime fishing. And then of course, as summer rolls around, it's pretty much all daytime fishing. You know, you're going for pelagics in the South Shore inlets, you know, sharks and rays in the ocean surf, uh, even, you know, bottom fishing, fluke, porgies, sea bass, you know, that's all, all broad daylight fishing, but right now, not getting so much sleep. All right, I'm just gonna grab a bunker here, and I'm not sure I'll either chunk with it or set a trap. There we go. All right, so I'm gonna chunk up this bunker and put them on this inline circle hook here with a 60 pound leader, little uh, high-low rig, and I got a one ounce weight because there's really no current here. Let's see. And while I wait on the bait, I'm gonna throw that black SP minnow on another rod. Right, sun's up now, no takers on the bunker chunk. Something little. Nice tiny little striper. Later, bud. There he goes. All right, well, so far just that one tiny fish, but at least we know now, you know, the fish are moving east and it should be really good soon. So thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, please like and subscribe and ring that bell for notifications on future content. See you all in the next video.